all ain't as well in paradise as as we thought all isn't as well in paradise as we thought what's up what's happening it's big ka we back in this thing K so good they sleep with a cutter up a ton the nigga on a ton i've been gone i'm going to get back you know what i'm saying hey holiday season got to see a lot of people got to touch a lot of people i've been slacking don't worry 2024 i'm going crazy i'm going buku on niggas fuck niggas talking about i'm going buku anyways we we'll talk about it now Cardi b she announced this i don't know if they're having some troubles or whatever we here to speculate this ain't 100 percent but apparently she announced that she's single response to offset and Krishan rock rumors now i don't know if there was some turmoil that was going through some shit to the point they were single you know we have another offset cheating rumor there was remember a time you know when she was dropping her album she had to be careful uh, Offset was making a grand gesture trying to uh, win his girl back in a sense and you know that happened now Do I believe Offset's out here fucking Krishan Rock? No, I don't know why Offset would fuck Krishan Rock But then again, we have seen niggas just fuck, fuck pussy And maybe she got a good pussy, so hey, it is what it is But we're here to talk about it, we're going to read this little article and we're going to speculate on shit that happened Now before all that, hey, like, subscribe, help your boy, I'll help your boy girl, you know what it is, you know I'm the kid, you know I talk my itty bitty little flares, you heard me But anyways, we're here to talk about Cardi B and Offset Now this is my thing with them peoples, right? Now so far, we thought it was good. They've been married. They got some kids. We thinking everything is good. Everything there ain't no issues or none. But clearly, there seems to be some tension. I don't know. Maybe Offset. You know, he dropped his album. His album did well. Cardi B helped with his album. He feeling like the man. He trying to do what he want. You know, trying to do his thing. Cardi B ain't really bitch. She said she gonna drop music. She might drop it twenty four. The singles haven't been hitting. Nicki just dropped her project. Nicki shitting on everybody as she usually does and. To keep it a book, hey, as much as I love y'all female artists, the Cardis, the Mulattoes, and everybody else, y'all can't rap with Nicki. Like, it's just understood at this point. Y'all can't bar it up with Nicki. Like, it is what it is at the end of the day. She been calling Megan Thee Stallion Bigfoot for years. And Meg has never responded. Meg, like, when you say my name, that's when I respond. And I'm saying your name. You know, but they keep doing that slick shit. Besides Lotto. Lotto, you kind of like, yeah, you talking about Nick. Especially that public spat they had. So it's like, yeah, you talking about Nick. You know, but Nikki just been that bitch and a lot of these girls who come up in this you know you took something from Nikki like you got some influence if you will from Nikki I'm not saying y'all stole some shit but like you know so there's a little bit of I'd say respect cause Nikki has done her thing bro she was unchallenged for years so if y'all motherfuckers going this should be another video but if y'all niggas going to try to come challenge her y'all gotta come correct I know I went on the soliloquy and uh, I went on the side note but anyways let's get back here anyways one of your biggest ops has um dropped their album. The album has did well. I think she did like uh she sold like two hundred and twenty two thousand copies first week, which is very good. You know, clap it up for Nick. You know, she's doing well, you ain't really dropping shit. She talking shit about you. You know, you trying to you wanna talk shit back, yada yada yada. So I don't know exactly what's going on. I'm just speculating on factors that could make them niggas fight. But anyways, let's keep going. So Cardi B is easily one of the biggest artists in rap right now. She is a big artist. She hasn't dropped shit in a while. You know? And now her husband is too. Her husband Offset is too. However, there have been some trouble in paradise as of late for the two. Last week it was reported that the two had unfollowed each other on social media. Also, couples fight, bro. We know this. Regardless if they're famous or not. Let's not act like couples don't fight. They don't go through like regular, regular arguments like us who are not in the limelight like that. Anyways. Furthermore, over the weekend, Blueface came out and said that Offset recently, you know what I'm saying, had relations with Krishan Rock. Overall, it was overall, overall, it was a pretty wild rumor to find out about fans, could not believe it, and it led to a whole lot of chatter throughout social media. Offset and Krishan Rock were quick to deny the rumors, however, a lot of fans wanted to hear from Cardi B. After all, she is the one who would be getting cheated on here. Well, this morning, the artist went on uh, Instagram Live where she addressed the fans and the rumors themselves. As you can see in the video below, she makes a pretty large revelation here. She is now single. Yes, that is right, Cardi B and Offset have broken up and Cardi now sees herself as a single one. Cardi B, I fuck with you. I get what you're trying to say. Maybe y'all is having some issues. Y'all taking a little break, you know. You doing your thing, he doing his thing. Maybe he not even staying at the crib. Or you not staying at the crib. I don't know. But, bro, y'all married. Y'all can't say y'all single. Y'all taking a break. Y'all going through some issues. You feel like, you know what I'm saying, you back on the single life. I think that's what she's trying to say. But, like, bitch, until y'all ass get a divorce, you're not truly single. But, like, I die, girl. I'm going to let you rock. I'm going to let you cook, you know, say your little piece and everything. But, anyways, I'm going to keep going. 
I want to start 2024 fresh and open. So wait, I ain't going to speculate. Unless y'all going to do some open marriage shit. Hey, anyways. <clears throat> As for the rumors themselves, Cardi said that she does not believe it is true. However, she doesn't really care whether it's true or not. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I had to cough real quick. That is because she is single. Furthermore, she said that she never made an announcement uh, pertaining to all of this because she doesn't really know how to approach it at the moment. That said, with Blueface blowing things wide open, she figured now would be as good of a time as ever just to come clean with what is going on. In the neighborhood talk post above, you can also see that Offset himself, like the original report of Cardi being Seagull, uh, needless to say, he is confirming the news as well. So, again, until y'all niggas get it over, it's so a no disrespect. Y'all niggas not truly single, but hey, do your thing. I ain't mad at you. Handle your business. Now, all I really got to say about this is, I personally did not believe Offset was smash Christian Rock. Did you see, like, when he was with Cardi B? This nigga was fucking some thick African. This bitch was thick. Thick. And no disrespect to Krishan. Like, she cool and everything. She's actually pretty. She just dumb shit. She's a, she's a nice looking girl. She just does a lot of dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? This whole blue face shit. Like, y'all nigga. Hey. Zeus must be paying them niggas with all the dumb shit they be doing. But regardless. Um. Sorry. What the fuck? I lost train of thought. But yeah. I don't think he would have fucked Krishan Rock. But then again, motherfuckers was smashing Selena Power. And again, Selena Power just be doing too much. I don't know why niggas would be trying to smash this girl who is known to just hook up with celebrities and try to finesse them. But I digress, you know. The entertainment business is different. With that being said, hey, it is what it is. Apparently, Guard to be single. I've said single. So, hey, motherfuckers, if y'all trying to shoot your shot, hey, Slide up in their DMs and handle your business, okay? But besides that, man, until y'all officially get divorced, it is what it is. I don't know if y'all like some common. I don't know if y'all niggas signed a marriage certificate. Y'all could pull out Yandy and man, DC. Man, DC's however you say Brody name. But yeah, besides all that, man, hey, it is what it is. We shall see what happens. And yeah, hey. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker says tis cuffing season. Looks like it's tis breakup season. You know what I'm saying? But hey, besides all that, I'm your friendly neighborhood K.A. Sign out for today. The black TJ there while the noonest time. My name ring goes like Quasimodo. He lashed the sky. He tried to hit a little bit more. You heard me? I'm gone. Shlimes on P. Charge, gang. Aye.